In less than a month, the best track and field athletes across the state will take over lacrosse for the state track meet. But for now, it's all about fine tuning those details and hitting the last stretch of the season in full stride. That's exactly what was going on today during the Blackhawk Invitational. Let's go to Viroqua High School where 10 of our area schools were facing off. Let's start with the girls 4x800 relay. Brookwood had the top time coming into the race, but it was Westby who got off to the fast start behind Audra Johnson. Then it was Elizabeth Curtis taking it down the stretch as Westby finished with a top time of 10-5-2. And for the boys race, it was West Salem coming down the final stretch. Panthers crossing the line with a time of nine minutes, six seconds. Switching to the girls, 100 meter hurdles. Westby's Megan Nelson takes first with a time of 16.57. Viroqua freshman Alana Christensen coming in second. In the boys race, doing it on his home track, Viroqua sophomore Caden Sullivan takes first with a new PR, 16.44. Hillsboro's Russell Jackson setting a PR in second place. 100 meter dash, West Salem's Carter Walter is going to cross the finish line in first with a time of 11.43 here. Bangor's Brand Gilbertson right behind him in second place. Girls race and Cashton's Braley Hyatt is flying. She takes first with a time of 12.91. Westby's Erin Gluck in second. We didn't get it on video, but Gluck set a new PR and high jump, clearing 5-5. Five, five. So the defending high jump state champ is reaching new heights as she looks to defend that crown. 